preparations are underway inside, outside, a much different approach at Caesars Palace. Protesters against Senator Harry Reid and the president have gathered there, and they would like to see some changes. I-Team reporter Jonathan Humber joins us live from the Strip. Jonathan, uh, what's the scene look like there? Well, it's certainly a busy one, Dave. You know, when we have politics meet the strip, it's definitely entertainment meeting the political world. And you can see a lot of folks already pretty fired up about the situation. You have folks of all ages mixing together pretty upset about uh, Senator Reid uh, being here and getting a boost from Obama. A lot of folks looked at Nevada and particularly the West as the way Obama won the White House. So it's definitely important that uh, Obama comes and once again pays patronage. But as you can see there, that is exactly the attitude that a lot of conservatives have towards Senator Harry Reid and also President Obama. Those on the other end say, well, you know, without Senator Reid, Nevada would see a lot less attention, and we certainly wouldn't have that clout with the majority leader having that D and that Nevada every time that he has that name. So you can see a lot of folks from all different uh, creeds and ethos being here, a lot of attention being paid to what they think uh, needs to change. But, you know, the word loyal opposition keeps coming to mind, that these folks are definitely out here, very peaceful, uh, not too quiet, though. They're definitely enjoying themselves and getting their word out, but it's definitely going to get a lot louder. Uh, as uh, the president arrives and gets a little closer. A lot of folks are still waiting. They may see him, they may not, but again, they're definitely going to get their voices heard. Reporting live in the Las Vegas Strip, Jonathan Humbert, Channel 8 Eyewitness News.